hello and welcome or welcome back to Sunshine Studios! Right now I'm kind of really happy because LPS Cobalt commented on one of my videos and I love his customs. So to get his input on my own is just unbelievable. And I'm just really happy right now. So that's the explanation for the many voice cracks that are probably to come in this video. Anyways, I don't know if any of you know what I'm talking about, but I believe it was either LPS Honey or Alice LPS that did this patchwork draft custom a few years back, and I really liked the concept, so I took it to a cat mold, baby. I tried something a bit different with this one and worked on it over the course of a few days instead of all in one sitting, but I usually create less complex customs, and this took a lot more detail. It took me four days to finish this one, which isn't bad for something that turned out pretty decent. And with that, let's talk about what summer will mean for my channel. I will stick to uploading Saturdays, but maybe there will be special occasions where I can possibly upload more than once. It's a definite yes that I will continue my customs and maybe even start a series with the extra time on my hands. In a few weeks I have finals, but I haven't planned that far ahead, and state testing is undetermined at the moment. I find that using straight up acrylic paint for smaller details can be tricky and sometimes turn out chunky, which is not what you want. I usually mix the paint color of my choice with some Mod Podge or glue, clear or just the regular school glue. It goes on a bit easier and is a bit glossy too. I use this most often for eye details but the stitches were a special occasion. Only now do I realize that I actually filmed most of me putting on the details for the different fabric scraps when I didn't think I filmed the detail work at all, so that's great. And this is just an idea, you don't have to do this if you don't want to, but if you made it this far in this video, comment the star emoji, cherry emoji, and unicorn emoji just to confuse the people who didn't watch the whole thing. And this is me showing off the finished custom because I never did in the previous footage. I added some other patterns to the tail and chest area that I think are super cute and I love it so, so, so much. And I just took this opportunity as a chance for some photography with it which I think turned out really cute and I was considering modeling it with my cats. They didn't want to cooperate. No surprise there! 